For this one, we're going to start once again by seeing if the if we can factor that denominator, which we can, right? What two numbers multiply to negative 6 and add to negative 1? That is going to be negative 3 and positive 2. Okay, negative 3 plus 2 is negative 1. Cool. And this equals A over that first binomial plus B over the second x plus 2. Okay, now we're going to multiply by this denominator here against both sides. So we're going to multiply everything by x minus 3 times x plus 2. Now I'm going to choose specific values of x that are going to find me a and b. And I'm going to choose smart values. I'm going to choose negative 2 first. Why? Because it's going to zero out this. Now we're going to go back to this equation. And now instead of plugging in negative 2, I'm going to plug in positive 3. Okay, why? Because it's going to zero out this guy. And that's going to allow us to solve nicely for a. So now we have values for b and a. Let's plug them in to this expression over here. And that is your final answer. Boom. Done.